Hey YouTubers, welcome back to another episode here on ESG and Net of MLB 15, the show. Row the show with Diego Torres. This is episode 15, and we are getting ready for his second start here in Major League Baseball as he made his first start against Miami and lost that one of a score of 4 to 2. Now, not the best pitching he we've seen him in before, uh, but definitely he definitely showed his uh I guess his uh, skills as a rookie when it comes to pitching here. He did get rocked there. He got uh, two home runs knocked off of him, uh, one by Stanton and one by uh, Salton Maki on that game. Uh, but anyway, we're going to put that uh, to the past now as he's made a start here as a Major League Baseball player. Now we're getting ready for our next uh, game here with him. And you see there, the uh, Chicago Cubs lead the series here against uh, Washington two games to one. And they're hoping to see if they can win this series by getting another game here and beat them three to one. There you see now seven games out of first place there. And now as the Cardinals are still leading it there in the Central, 32 and 25 there. Uh, Brewers are just a half game behind them here. But, you know, it's early in the season still. It's, what, uh, month of June. Still got enough time here to make up some ground here and win some games here and uh, be a contender here in the Central Division. So, uh, that being said here, we'll take a look at the Nationals. There you see they are 30 and 26. They are first place here in the National League East. Braves are just a half game behind them, uh, along with the Mets, just a year shot of them, a, a game and a half there. And, of course, the Marlins also just not that far from them, uh, two games. So, uh, just a half a game between those th uh, Braves, Mets, and Marlins there. So still, anyone can take this division, but right now, the Nationals have it. And they are playing some pretty good baseball. So we got 1,369 points here. We're going to kind of spread these around here on some areas that are kind of, uh, you know, uh, going down here. Uh, we'll just take a look at some of these things that we want to kind of upgrade. But... So I'm going to Torres here uh, after that last game there, his first start as a major league pitcher. He said, you know, uh, it's kind of what he was expecting, but at the same time not what he was wanting to make as a standard. He didn't want to make any excuses. Uh, you know, he knows that the club has, a, you know, has some issues right now with pitching that they need to kind of get dealt with. Uh, some of the starting pitchers are not pitching right now that well. And he wants to be able to con contribute in the positive sense and not just be a guy that they bring up. And all of a sudden now, um, you know, he's part of the roster and um, doesn't perform as, you know, as great and as well as he was down in the minors. Uh, so uh, he's going to be here in Washington. Uh, he's going to be going against uh, Steven Strasburg, which we'll see the numbers here in just a bit uh, as we get them. Um, putting these uh, points here on our uh, attributes here but yeah just overall just uh, he wants you know we'll see the st uh, standings here uh, there you see the numbers there for the team stats there you guys can pause the video and check those out but uh, yeah uh, he's been getting talking to John Lester and, and uh, Jake Aurelia and, and so many others there about pitching uh, talking to uh, his pitching coach a lot and to see what he can uh, how you perf you know perfect or you make his not necessarily perfection but uh, you know make his pitches better uh, make him more sharper and uh, and how to get and if you know he can't strike a house you get him out you know by way of ground out and stuff like that and put some trust behind uh, his uh, his um, uh, defense here because uh, he has a great defense behind him that's supporting him so you know trust and put some trust in his infield there and whatnot. And see, you know, and, and, you know, if he can't get him out, then hopefully, you know, he can rely on those guys to help him out. But there you see 11 starts there for Strasburg, uh, 6 and 4 there for him. He's only had one no decision so far this season. And we'll see him in action here. But we'll see Torres first. We'll see bottom of the first here, two outs. And that's going to be a ground out there. That right there, I believe, is, uh, I think that was Bryce Harper that time that was out. And now we're in the innings there. So after one now, no score. Bottom to second now with one out. Here we'll see. Actually, though, this is Harper here. And he will ground out there. Nice play right there. And that will be an out. So uh, there you see that defense there helping him out there. And Harper, of course, 
Uh, well, just a rookie just a couple of years ago here. Now seeing this rookie pitch. So now 2-2. Two -two, and that's going to be a strikeout right there. Nice play. And that will end the inning there. So after two, no score here for either club. So now we go ahead and go to the bottom of the third here. One, two pitch. No way out. No way on board. And this is going to be a pop-up. This is going to go back. This is going to go deep. Will this go out of the ballpark? It will. That's going to be a home run right there. And again, Torres just does not do a good job there with his location. He gives up another home run. That's his third home run he's given up this season. And we'll see here that, yeah, the uh, manager there of Washington loves it. But I think the uh, Chicago fans there on the north side are thinking, okay, this kid is not pitching the way he was pitching down there in Tennessee. We may need to bring him back down there but we'll see here one nothing now bottom of third here we've got a one one pitch here this is a ground ball this is going to be an out right here nice defensive play there and again Torres is going to have to trust his defense here to help him out keep the ball low on the ground so Castro and the rest of the team here can get those ground balls and get the out so there you see now one out nobody on board one two pitch here and Strasburg does a nice swing right there nice stroke from him he'll get a single there and that will put him at first base. So the fellow pitcher there, not, he getting a hit off of his counterpart here in this at bat. Here we'll see Strasburg, nice swing right there. Strasburg is one of those few uh, pitchers out there that can actually hit also. So now one out here, runner at first here, one zero pitch here. We'll see Torres. He'll this will be a ground out here. This is gonna be a nice double play here. As oh Torres forgets to go to first right there. Ah. That's something he has to remember to do here is that you're a fielder. Once you pitch, throw that ball there, you're no longer the pitcher. You're now a fielder, and you need to go to first to cover first base. So that's going to be on him on that one. 0-2 pitch here. Ground out here. We'll see here. That's going to be a force out there at second. And he gets out of that jam there with his defense helping him out. So just a little blunder there with, again, that home run. And then, uh, you know, uh, not covering first there. But they end up uh, lead this one now. Lead this one out, 2-1, bottom of the fifth here. Nice strikeout right there from Torres as Torres just rings that one up and takes that guy out to the shed there on that one. So Torres doing a good job here when it comes to the mound so far here. They got some little run support here with a one-run lead here. 3-2 oh, count here, fastball right there outside the zone there. That's going to be a strikeout there again. And again, Torres looking hot now. He is heating up here. As we'll see, another strikeout here. Nice play. As we see the replay there. And we'll see here now 2 1 pitch here for the next at bat. Two outs. And there you see, this will be a ground out there. And uh, Castro's going to try to make a play here at first. And oh, yes, he does. Nice play. Nice throw right there from Sterling Castro as he helps out the rookie there to get out of the inning. So after five, it's 2 1. And the car, uh, the uh, Cubs still lead it here. Now, bottom of the six here, we'll see Strasburg up the bat here. He'll swing and a miss. That's going to be a strikeout there. Torres says, oh, no, you got me once. Uh, no, nah, it ain't going to happen again. So you see five and a third innings of work. Two hits, one earned run, run, one run. Eight strikeouts here and 78 or 75 pitches already in the ball game. So now 2-2 two, two pitch here with one out. Nobody on board here. And this is going to be a pop-up. This is going to go deep. This one's going to go back. That one hits off the wall there. The uh, left fielder out there misses that one. He has to track this one down, and he's going to throw it in there. And there you see Torres doing a good job here, covering first here, or covering at home there, backing up the uh, catcher there. And that right there will be a triple here. As we'll see here, Torres just cannot believe that the left fielder tried to go after one like that. And the guy left his feet there. You don't want to do that. So now we'll go bottom of the fur or still bottom of the six here with one out. Runner at third, and Torres does a nice job striking the runner the batter out there and keeping the runner there at third. As again, Torres now I, I think he's heating up. He knows it. He wants he wants to make sure he can get this win here for this team. As he gave up a home run here. We'll see the replay here. Nice throw right there. And yeah, there's no shot at that one at all for the batter. So now, 0-1 pitch here. We'll see here. Worth will be up. He will get a ground ball here, and that will get thrown in. 
And that right there will be the out. So the runner stranded at third. And the Cubs still lead it 2-1 to one here after six innings of play. Now we'll see Ryan Zimmerman up over to the day. Strikeout and a ground out. We'll see here, bottom of the seventh here. He'll hit this one. That's going to be a nice uh, ball here. That's going to go all out to the right field here. Right field is going to throw that one in to second. And almost a call there. Almost got the uh, runner there as Zimmerman gets a double. Nice play right there from him. And Torres is thinking, okay, I'm back on the stretch once again. And I got to get out of the trouble. I got to get out of this inning and, and make sure no, uh, not score. But there you see Joe Madden's like, nope, kid, you're done. I'm going to go ahead and do a double switch here. And we got this for you. We're going to get this win for you. As we got a one-run lead here in the game. As you see, Bryce Harper will be up to bat. And he'll end up uh, getting out. And now we'll see the simulation here. Joe Madden says that he's going to try to help this kid as much as possible because he sees a bright future with him. And we'll see here. Anthony Rizzo will come in as a pitch hitter. And we'll see that Strope is now in there. And now it's 3-1 now. Chicago's leading this one here late in the ball game. Hopefully they can hold on to this uh, two-run lead here. As Baez uh, does nothing there. He pops out. And we'll see Herrera. He'll go to second. We've got Castro on third. Nice run there. Now 5-1 now for the, uh, for the Cubs here. And we'll see here the North Siders of Chicago may have this one by Jason Mott. And yeah, let's see. Let's see what the score was. And the final score doesn't look like no fireworks are going off. Yeah, Cubs win this one 6 to 1. Torres gets his first win of the year. Strasburg will get his fifth loss of the season. He is 6 and 5. Torres 1 and 1. And Torres will get the win. So nice there. And Torres. Is being called player of the game. So he get his first MVP here as a major league pitcher here with the Cubbies. As he will pick up the win here. And a nice win here. The Cubs do a great job here. Uh, tacking on some more runs there. And he will get credit for the win here in this ball game. So nice win there. They win this one by six. Of a final score. Of six to one there so nice win there and what uh yeah just yeah six to one final there just a nice win there and happy that torres he said he is ecstatic he is happy and he called his mom and dad and told them that uh, about the win they said they watched the game there on mlb.tv and I'm very proud of their son there getting that win there so he'll get 50 points for his first mlb win he'll get 50 points also for his uh, quality uh, start, and he also get another, I think, 50 points there for the win. So, uh, that being said, we're getting ready to go out to Chicago. Actually, he'll get 30 points for the win. And he told his mom and dad that, hey, I want you guys to come back out. I want you guys to see me play in my home stadium, that, which is Wrigley Field. And we'll see him in the next episode, pitching the first time at Wrigley. But we'll see here first. We're still just a couple games back. We're six games now back from the leader there. You see the Cardinals again. Now they have a one-game losing streak. The Brewers, Cardinals, and Pirates all lost this last game. Um, and are looking, uh, you know, kind of, you know, they still got the lead there, but uh, looking a little shaky there. But we'll see here uh, was next star as Jason Hamill will get the uh, first start there. The, the Detroit game. We will get, like I said, the third game here. Uh, there against uh, the Reds. There at home at Wrigley. So it's gonna be a nice start. I can't wait to see him in uh, the Wrigley, playing there at Wrigley Field, that historical uh, stadium. I've been there before in real life, and it, and it just really takes my breath away every t uh, when I was there. Just it was amazing. So hopefully Diego will have the same kind of uh, same kind of luck that he had there in Washington. And have the same kind of feeling that I had when I went to Wrigley Field. Just as a fan there, I just went there to check it out. So, uh, definitely, guys, come on back for another episode of MLB 15, the show. Row the show with Diego Torres as we get ready for episode 16. And we'll face the Reds here in game three of a four-game series there, a weekend series there. And the next episode there at uh, on the north side of Chicago there at Wrigley. So, 
If you guys, uh, again, like I said, enjoy the episode, uh, hit that like button. Also, subscribe to the channel as we're a little over 300 subscribers here on the on uh, ESGN Net. Uh, not to mention, you guys can follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Tumblr. The links are down below uh, in the description. We have so many people that have joined us there on the channel. Uh, they're on Facebook and Twitter and Tumblr. Thank you guys so much. Continue getting the word out there about the channel. And as always, keep yourselves really healthy, and I will see you guys next time.